Hey everyone, welcome to Permanent Records with Mark. Uh, this past week I've had a birthday and some great people got me some really great albums for my birthday and I'd like to share them with you. So let me start off with, let me tell you, I'm a jazz guy. I love jazz records and I've been listening to jazz since my early mid-twenties. And I got a couple jazz records. I got Oliver Nelson's The Blues and the Abstract Truth. Amazing album. <clears throat> this has some of the best blues music, I mean jazz rather, musicians on here. Freddie Hubbard, Paul Chambers, and the great Bill Evans on piano. It's an amazing album. One thing I've always liked about jazz albums too, liner notes on the back. So I can really get my geek on and read all about this album on the back too. Uh, also, another great jazz album I got, Art Blakey's Jazz Messengers featuring Thelonious Monk. Thelonious Monk and Art Blakey always had a great relationship. Art Blakey played on many of his albums, so he returned the f so Thelonious returned the favor and played on some of his. This came out in 1958. Another great, amazing jazz record. Art Blakey is one of the great drummers of jazz, if not all music. Them, uh, give it a listen if you've never listened to it. Amazing. One of the classic albums, the second Motorhead album, Overkill. A lot of people are going to tell you Ace of Spades is the greatest Motorhead album. No, it's Overkill. Ace of Spades is amazing, <clears throat> but this is actually, I think, their best album. This has all the classics. Damage Case, Overkill, Capricorn. It's great, amazing album. I suggest picking it up if you've never listened to it. This is probably, I think, Motorhead at their finest. And last but not least... The new Anthrax. I've had this on Spotify for a while and I've been meaning to get it, but someone got it for me for my birthday. I love the fact that Joey Belladonna is back in the band. This is the second album with Joey Belladonna. You can't really have Anthrax without him. And what's really cool about it is it has this, it has this outer sleeve that you slide off. Anthrax for All Kings. It slides off and reveals this really great artwork. It's album artwork. If there's one thing I've always missed about the CD age and the MP3 age, Great album artwork. This is done by Alex Ross. If you read a lot of DC Comics, he does a lot of their covers. He is a great cover artist. He did this. It's got all the lyrics inside. And also what I like too, this is on really nice blue vinyl. See? And the back has an etched pentagram in it. It's an amazing album. It is one of the best ones, I think. So what do you think? You get anything good for your birthday? You get anything good for Christmas? Let me know. If you like your, if you like it, please like it. If you want to subscribe, subscribe. And if you want to leave a comment, please leave a comment right down below. Thank you, and have a great day.